Okay, everybody. So today we're going to talk about tractor supply. And we're going to talk about tractor supply because of this. I'm not complaining about the price, that's for sure. I'm not complaining about the product either. It does the job. What I am not really complaining about, but what I'm talking about is tractor supply is high as crap. Um, the only time that I really get stuff is if I'm really in a bind and need something or if it's on clearance. Like, look at this. It's a tripod sprinkler um, in which, like, I think that uh, people have seen, and I'll also do a video of uh, the sprinklers. I got, I got bought five of them. Um, that's all they had left. And, uh, and actually, I bought six. I gave one to my mom, and then I kept five. Um these sprinklers are good to go the only problem that i've had with it is you know i haven't done anything with this this sprinkler and somehow the bolts and and uh have worked their way out or they didn't put them in there wherever the case may be and i gotta fix that before i can use it which i'm getting ready to put uh, a bolt and stuff in it and use it and have two uh, sprinklers at the same time. Um, and now that I realize, this one's missing a leg. The leg must be in the back corner where the uh, the other ones are. So I have to go find that. But um, this video is basically just to you know talk about tractor supply, the the cost, and also if you get something like this, um, this is the second one that I'm using, and it also uh, had the bolts fall out and they've never been used as you can see the the stakes are still right there and they still got the tag on which i have to take off so it will rotate and spin but um if you get this tripod sprinkler um be sure to tighten the bolts like really 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 tight because they come from the factory they just fall out and that's all i have to say about that like forrest gump